so it's our last day in Udaipur actually we're not staying here anymore we're leaving everyone is in the bus already we're just waiting for our tour guide to come and there's the lavender <laughs> the boy that we call lavender he is saying goodbye to us and following us so yeah we're going to Jodhpur and I have a sore throat and a runny nose because of air conditioners which is so annoying so I have a candy to help my sore throat now and by the way I'm gonna I'm gonna show you my henna this is what it looks like today so yeah the color got a lot brighter and darker through the night and I absolutely love it my dad absolutely hates it so I cannot look at it it makes me want to throw up the funny thing is that my mom also has henna so my dad cannot look at it so yeah I guess I will see you on the way maybe we'll stop at some destination look at this chipmunk so cute I love them there, there are so many of them Today already. Look at our guide wearing a winter sweater. Here is the temple. So beautiful. So I'm not going into the temple, and some of us aren't, because it's Chinese temple, I believe. And you cannot bring anything there, no leather accessories, no belt, no bag, no shoes, no food, no water, cameras, like nothing, even if you have PMS you cannot enter, it's like the rules are really really strict. So I'm just gonna sit here and observe it from the outside. So we eventually went into the temple. It was so beautiful there, but I didn't take my camera because you have to pay quite a lot for filming or for taking pictures, but like everything was carved out of marble and the details were so intricate and there were like these, so many of these pillars and yeah it's like one of the most beautiful temples I've ever been to, it's just stunning in there, I'm so sad I couldn't show it to you guys. But, yeah. It's really really yeah. hot here. Yeah. Trying to protect my my head. And yeah, basically these people, their um, philosophy is really really strict. They don't eat any meat. They don't even eat things that like vegetables that grow in the ground, like garlic or herbs, nothing like that. So it's a very strict religion. Um, yeah, these are the religious guys staring at me because I kind of look like Indian you know with my head and the scarf and my Indian trousers I'm gonna sneeze because I have such runny nose I hate conditioners hair conditioners we will go to have some lunch because I'm already starving it's afternoon it took 50 years to build a temple we had like audio guide and uh, there are 12 million followers in this philosophy I don't want to say religion because I think it's like a philosophy rather um, so yeah I'll see you later We're sitting here to have a meal and we just realized that there's wedding going on. So it's the second day of wedding. <laughs> 
Плоткиным. Here is the bride, the girl. She's probably like 17 or 16. And look at that, there is a camel. Wow, he's coming here. They saw us. <laughs> okay, I think it's gonna be picture time. <laughs> Какой я муж, мой слыхар? Я говорю, туман, ты плейки, там ты же много шерги Guys, the hotel we're staying at tonight, just for one night, it's insane. It's like a museum. It's so, so beautiful. It's insane. Look at that. So our room is upstairs. Wow. I've never ever <laughs> stayed in such a hotel. My camera ran out of battery, and I had to charge it. And sorry for my stuffy nose as well. So this hotel is incredible. We were saying it's it was probably like a, a palace or castle of some Maharaja or something. Because it's so beautiful. It's like a museum. So we just had some coffee here that we brought from home. Um, this is downstairs. So so gorgeous and so romantic you can see the sky it's like open and here's my aunt and my little cousin's room which is beautiful and I'm gonna show you um, my granny's and mine room which is in there so I'm gonna do the tour a little bit later I think we're leaving at 8 30 so yeah we're just gonna sleep here tonight and leave early in the morning and then we'll drive with our bus somewhere else to visit um by the way i didn't even mention did i we are in jodhpur tomorrow we will visit the city and then at two i believe in the afternoon we will head to jaipur so now we are in jodhpur we'll be going to jaipur um yeah that's that we spent seven hours in the bus today and we only drove 300 kilometers and it took seven hours because, you know, the cows are holy here, so they're everywhere. Okay, so we are heading out. The stairs are really, really steep here. So we are just heading for a little bit to the city. It's actually really quite dangerous, full of traffic. And this is the outside. Actually, it's not so chaotic here, but like we are in the middle of the center or Old Town. Maybe it's Old Town, I'm not even sure. Hello. This place is very 
slum like very dirty shouldn't walk here you can't even compare to Udaipur I wonder if all of Jodhpur is like that because it's a very dirty city we're going back to our hotel um, to just relax because we were sitting in the bus all day so we're a little bit tired and yeah, I'm, I'm not sure I like this place Udaipur was amazing, it was beautiful yeah, it did have dirty places but it was a very romantic and beautiful city and Jodhpur, um, maybe it's just the first impression and uh, maybe I didn't see like the nicer areas. This one doesn't look very nice. <laughs> Dogs are fine. <laughs> Hello. Hey, here we are back to our hotel. Just so beautiful. This city is definitely a city that has a smell because in other ones everyone says it stinks in India yada 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 it doesn't not at all I mean yeah of course there are places where you can smell pee and stuff because the streets aren't very clean but the air I mean it doesn't smell bad but in this city it smells of incense sorry I was interrupted well I was saying that this city smells of incense and yeah basically Jodhpur has a very distinct smell. My granny is in the restaurant with the others where we're gonna have breakfast tomorrow. Anyways, this is the entrance. This is like a little lounge area. Oh my God, I'm like really, really sick. And uh, here are our beds. And here you've got these beautiful Doors, I just love these handles so much. Here and ta-da! Here's our bathroom. The toilet and everything. Here's me, I have like a little wardrobe in here. I think it's so lovely. 